Hi, it's exciting times. It's a wrap, as they say in the, in the industry. We have just finished uh, filming our first TV commercial. We've got a great product. We've got some amazing um, feedback from our guests where we're scoring nine out of 10 in our uh, cuisine, our crew friendliness, and our entertainment. We decided it was time to bring our brand and our proposition to the wider world. We're about authenticity. We're a traditional cruise line. Um, and what we wanted to showcase was that friendliness, the amazing entertainment, that outstanding cuisine that we have. We have filmed the advert with our crew, our entertainment team, and believe it or not, our own guests. We had over 350 guests that wanted to be part of our, our commercial. Why we've used the actual dancers and the entertainment team and the singers in our ad is because they're one of the highest rated feedback we get from, from our guests. And we felt, well, why not use our real entertainment team? This is what you, the authenticity of our brand. You come on board, you will see these people. The song has been actually around for about um, six, seven months before. Um, we were looking for a song that was authentic and again, played to our demographic. Enjoy yourself, we're the ones to choose. If I have to think back and say what is the most challenging scene we've had, I think it was definitely the, the end scene on the top deck. We had our whole dance crew, which was the best part of six or seven people. We had 350 guests who aren't trained actors, but who just wanted to be in it and wanted to be a part of it. I guess the, the second most challenging scene we probably had to film was Centre Court, trying to choreograph um, a dancer sliding down a, a banister on a moving ship. It's not the easiest thing to do. Then our, our second scene was in the botanical. That was slightly easier, I think, if I'm honest, to film, because we were able to close off a small area of the bar. But the challenge here with the botanical was trying to make sure the dancers and the waiters and the light that was coming from the bar behind was actually still choreographed um, well enough and shot well enough that actually we weren't getting the, the reflection in. So the challenge we found, and you'll see, it's got a huge glass mirror. So we're trying to make sure that we could utilize that. This was probably our easiest shoot because it involved just the talent we had on board. Although in saying that, it was probably one of the most challenging themselves for the entertainment team because there was a significant number of moves that needed to be choreographed and actually Shannon at the end had to be held up by two of the male dancers to be able to move on to the next scene. My favourite scene without a shadow of doubt was in my favourite bar, is the observatory. The observatory bar was used for um, our shot of the evening dance and show showcasing what happens at night on board. And what the, the entertainment team had on there, they had on um, stunning white dresses, which, were, which are actually made from recycled plastic from the ocean. And that is something that the entertainment team um, have created and sewn and stitched together. Buckingham Restaurant, the second to last scene that we, sh we shot, is something that I think is very close to my heart and what I wanted to showcase because it's where we really put the crew at the front of, of the ad. And I think what the key thing I want people to take away from this whole advert when they see it is we haven't made anything up. What you see is what you get. We are true, we are authentic, and we're delivering on our promise. So what you see on this ad is what you can experience on board Ambassador.